By providing a kitchen mat with anti-fatigue function for those who are standing on the hard and cold floor, he encouraged them to make micro-movement which keep blood circulating around their legs. Hi, Andy here. In this video, we're going to look into how a simple rubber kitchen mat can transform the productivity and reduce sick leave and employment turnover in commercial kitchen and which type of rubber kitchen mat material you should look for when buying one. Now, apart from the anti stiff function which is key, kitchen mat also provide comfort by absorbing short of impact from feet and various drop of jabs like utensils and cooking ware. According to Health, Safety and Environment Association, sleep and trips are the most common causes for injured in workplaces. A well-designed kitchen mat provides grip and stability so that those standing on them have traction with the floor, compared to fighting the steps from a potential sleeping on the wet, smooth surface. Anti fatigue to boost well being. Most kitchen employees are standing at the same spot all day, which can cause joint ache, muscle ache, headache, and fatigue. By providing a kitchen mat with anti fatigue function for those who are standing on the hard and cold floor, he encouraged them to make micro movement which keep blood circulating around their legs. The result less fatigue, higher productivity, and more motivated workforce because of the comfortable working environment. Plus, you will notice employees taking less time off and sick leave. They often caused by standing in the same position for too long. Better hygiene. In the event of spillages, which is likely in a busy kitchen, the dirt and debris will fall through the holes and be collected underneath the mat rather than being dragged across the floor as people walk around. And by end of business, just roll out and sweep away whatever that are underneath the kitchen mat. Protects floor and equipment. A proper kitchen mat also forms a barrier between the kitchen floor and anything that may drop onto it. Two things are happening here. The cooking equipment are being dropped and the floor that are being fall onto are less likely to become damaged. This is handy especially if there are a lot of glass ceramic items being used in the kitchen. Now you know why those bartenders keep tossing and throwing those bottles without breaking any glass or bottles. So how do you select the right one for your commercial kitchen? The material is the one you should look out for. Natural rubber which is perfect for floors that are wet and dirty but not compatible for oil and grease villages which makes them less ideal to be used in commercial kitchen. The better option is kitchen mat or in fact any floor mat that are made from natural rubber. This is because this material can withstand grease and oil spills and still provide traction. Plus, it is more resistant, washable and it has a longer lifespan compared to natural or recycled rubber which makes it a worthwhile investment and they are anti-static too. One quick tip to test whether they are natural or natural rubber. Natural and recycled rubber usually will have a very strong rubber smell and crack very easily whether they are minor or major crack. For natural rubber, usually it doesn't smell and it will not crack. Real people who sell the real natural rubber mat will give you that 2 years warranty. Crack is part of the warranty, you know, just in case you purchase a full spec kitchen mat that has a copy and paste spec sheet. Oh yes, select the design that has holes. Hope you get some insight out of this video, link is up or down below if you want to know more. Kitchen mat is one of the most essential and important piece of equipment any kitchen can use to increase safety. Are you still thinking about using the cardboard? Are you serious? 